Hey everyone, what's up? Give me and welcome to Whitehaven. Now, a few weeks ago, I did do the pro prologue, and uh, yeah, um, this game did actually come out a few days ago, but I was busy playing uh, Gravewood High, which I really enjoyed. I'm very excited for the other levels. Uh, but we are going to start playing Whitehaven. Um, yeah, uh, do you want to start a new game? Yes, of course. My name is Rachel, I, and I live in Whitehaven Orphanage. Two days ago, my friend Claire tried to leave the orphanage, but she got caught. She hasn't come back to our room yet. I'm very worried. I managed to get the room keys from the reception closet, and I'm going to get out of here tonight. I can't take it anymore. Alright, so... This is exactly like the beginning. So... Yeah. Okay. Uh... This is Mr. Kai, I'll leave him. Okay, so this is exactly how the game... Flashlight. Okay. Yeah, this is exactly how the prologue started. Uh, as a, as a little kid. So... Yeah, I guess, you know... I guess we can quickly do this. In hopes that... We can get past. This is okay. Cool. All right. I I do remember this a lot. Okay. All right. From the prologue. So this is actually just the prologue. We're not open because there's no electricity. I saw you. All right. So we got to get fuel there. That makes sense. Okay. Um. And here. Okay. So there should be fuel, a fuel can. Right here. You have a patrol can, cool. All right. Cool. All right. Don't. Don't do anything that I am going to regret. This should be enough. Yep, okay. Cool. Alright. So electricity is unlocked. Alright, so now... Uh, have me reach that window. Okay, so yes. We need... Uh, to find the ladder, which, if I recall correctly, is in that same room. Okay. Which is somewhere. Yeah, here. You have ladder. Hi. That door is locked. That door is locked, if I recall correctly. No, I can always recheck, but... Alright. Alright. Got through that pretty quickly. Thanks to the prologue. Some, um, Blessed Games presents. Sorry if I kind of. My name love that. is Rose Davies, and I used to work as a teacher at Whitehaven Orphanage. I feel like it's been a long time since then. I can barely remember what the place was like. Lately, I've been having dreams that evoke the orphanage headaches, anxiety. My therapist, Dr. Tramis, has recommended that I visit the place. Not a good idea. He says it might help me sort out my thoughts. Everything seems like a dream to me. Every day. Every second. I feel like I'm lost in fog. Hmm. Okay. Saving game.
All right. All right. We're almost there. Almost there, yes. All right. Looking good. Looking good. Very interested to see how long this is going to take. And if it has, if we can do this in one video. This place had its charm. This place had its charm. Okay. Well, let's go in. The door is stuck in one open. Well, that's a rip. Uh, oh. It's a stuffed bunny. Okay. Cool. Stuffed bunny. Oh. Okay, so this is... Okay. Yeah, so of course the side would be open. I'm going to go exploring here a little bit and see if we can find anything. If not, we'll go in. This looks... Hello? Tragedy in the orphanage. Okay. What is this? Orphanage key. Okay, that's cool. Okay. They're just old books. Okay. Okay, well, we got an uh, the orphanage key. I wonder. There was a door here that I we passed. Oh, it's boarded up. Well, okay, cool. So, I'm guessing the key fits, so I, I think I can get it. You think you can get in when it actually works? That's kind of. Okay, so we're in the orphanage. The lights are on. Is anybody here? Uh, I wouldn't say... Whitehaven Orphanage. The Whitehaven Orphanage is a non-profit institution for abandoned children. Here they will be able to develop and grow together, both in academic and social environments. Since 19 1875, we have taken care of all those unfortunate little ones, thanks to your donations. Our facilities allow children to access a large number of services, some of which include everything here. All right, cool. All right. The door is showed in, I can't open it. Well then, that's a rip. Uh, bathroom? Oh, and yet the guy's bathroom is open. Uh, just books. All right, let's... Let's go exploring here and see what's up. Mm, nothing. Okay, cool. Cool. All right. I remember this classroom. I used to work here. Okay. I mean, honestly, why? Oh, it's a teddy bear. Okay. Wow. I'm finding a lot of these things. Alright. Is there, am I just, I think we're just exploring right now. Okay. Well, exploring we must. It's jammed from the outside. Okay. Cool, it's jammed. Okay. Okay, this is the front. Okay. That's where we came from. Uh, the lock is through, so I think open it by passing something through it and the slit. Okay. I remember the painting. I always got on my nose. That looks like it would get on anybody's nose, Rhodes. Um. Ah, it's a grandfather clock. That's not gonna come bite me. I am the janitor. I am leaving this note in case anyone has seen the storage room keys. I left them on my desk, but I can't find them anywhere. I need to get some reports urgently, so I would appreciate it if you could keep an eye out on them for them. I heard some kids whispering in the bathroom, and I'm sure those kids are taking the keys. Do something about it. If you find them, let me know. I'll be in the yard trimming the hedges. Okay. Okay. Okay, that, hello? Uh. Okay, um, 
storage room key. Thank you, I guess. I am... I'm gonna just... Hmm. You have used the storage room key. Okay, cool. So we got that. Hello there. This is... I got a crowbar. What we do? Uh, employee data. Uh... I can't read it, something has birth on the page, okay. That's... Okay, I can't jump in it, okay. So we got a- bar is stained. It looks like... Dried blood. Bottom? The door's screwed in, I can't get it. Oh no, it's this. Okay, cool. Alright. Uh... These look... Ancient. As well, I got the. Uh, ma'am. I'm. Okay. Uh, part of me is terrified. Right now. Um. <laughs> Yeah, I'm using the hunt key. Okay. I'm just gonna close the door. Um, I say, can Harry? Um, I'm not gonna die, am I? Oh, like outside and inside. Okay then. Hello there. Hello. Oh. What's that? A box cutter. Why the heck will I need a what I need a box cutter for? Oh. Okay. Oh. Radiograph. Okay. Okay. Maybe. Maybe something. Oh. Oh. All right. Uh, was that a box cutter we used to open that? I think so. This name, amnesia, patients, uh, accident, fall, signs are not compatible with fall, she fell, signs not compatible, okay. Uh, it's full of similar reports, okay. Oh, I got a crayon. This is the key to our room a crayon. I remember. I remember the screams. The bruises. God, those poor children. We did all of this. I deserve all of this. It's my fault. Uh, why are you doubting yourself? Okay. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh. Okay. No. Okay. Alright. I'm guessing. Oh. Oh, it's a puzzle. Um Ok 
Okay. 202. Okay, let's see. I'm guessing this has something to do with the lockers. I guess we can see uh, room 202. Uh, 201. Alicia and Evie. Alicia and Evie. I wonder if there's something that tells us more about uh, Alicia and Evie. Okay. Cool. Dawn looks like it was made by a child. It has something went on the back. My name is Hannah, and these are my fans, Alicia and Oliver. The three of us live together at White Heaven Open. We are very different, but we love being together. Alisa loves animals and wants to be a marine biologist when she grows up, although I don't know if that exists. It does. My friend Oliver wants to be a musician. She says her parents were music musicians too. It makes me very envious when she talks about her parents. I never knew mine. I love to read and when I grow up I would like to write stories like the ones we have in the library. Okay, so Alicia, animal, so ping, the penguin, all of us are musicians, so I would say the m music uh, thing, and I love to read. Alright, uh, penguin, uh, so this would be some sort of music, uh, I'm guessing this, and then book. Alright. Um, oh, 202 is Al Al Oliver, Alicia and Evie, Alicia and Evie, okay, Alicia and Evie, okay, Alicia and Evie, Alicia wants to be a marine biologist, okay, so Alicia, so the marine biologist, so the penguin goes in room 202. So, penguin goes in room 202. Uh, let's see... 205. Let's see who 205 is and what they... Uh, are. 205. Hannah and Barbara. Okay, so Hannah's the reader. So the book would go... Okay. So, book? Okay, so... Oh, book and then the musician. The music. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, hello. That's still locked. Okay. Hey, I did it. Can I just close this? Um, oh god. Okay. Alrighty then. I guess. Um. Cool. What? Sorry, what? Oh, that door open. All right. Okay. This is this is actually creepy. Ah, what? What? What are you doing? I'm on the floor. Uh, that's not good. What? Oh. 
That just got up. Alrighty. I have no idea what happened. Alright. What does this say? Tragedy in the orphanage. White Heaven in the orphanage has been closed due to the disappearance of Blank. The girl disappeared last month without a trace and started an investigation on the orphanage. Police discovered the channel being abused at the place has been closed and the staff is in police custody. Alright. Alright. Okay then. Cool. Not cool, but it's locked. Sure. Uh, oh. Okay. Okay. Well, that's fun. Oh. This is fun. This does not look terrifying at all. It does, actually. I don't know why I'm lying to myself. Hello there. What is this? Remember the moon in the center of faces the moons remember the moon in the center face the moons the moon in the center face the moons okay moons in the center face the moons okay moons in the center Oh, so the moons are heading this way, so we go this way. Oh, okay, that took me a while to figure out what, what that meant. Oh. I have no idea what I did there, but okay. Okay, what's happening? I'm scared. Oh god. Okay. Uh... This is not good. I am losing my mind. Okay. okay. This, the walls are closing in all around me. Um. Okay. All right. Um. Oh. Okay, where am I going here? Oh. I'm confused. Hello? Oh. My head. I mean... Did kind of just fall from. I remember the sewer. The sewer? Please don't tell me we have to go in the sewers. Um, saving game. We're going in the sewers. That's not a good decision. That's not a good decision, but hey, you know. Okay. All right. We still cannot jump, and we can't run apparently. Oh look! Looks like there's a door. Uh. To absolute. Oh. I was gonna say to absolute darkness, but. Uh. Oh. You have a wooden plank. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. 
Alright. So we made it over the other side. I'm guessing... Uh, okay. Alright, so well, I guess we're just walking over... Oh, what is this? This is in my handwriting. This is a page from my diary. My name is Rose Davies, and I work as a teacher at Whitehaven Orphanage. I'm new here. I've only been working at the orphanage for a couple of months. However, it didn't take me long to realize that something was wrong. Mm. When I started, I was warned that these children might be troubled or need special treatment because of the things they had experienced. I'd worked with other children of all types before, and knew that the problem these children had was not in their past. My students brought marks and bruises practically every day. They were apathetic, and reacted with fear to anything. That's sad. One day I went to see Dr. Tramis, the doctor in charge of children's health here at Whitehaven. Shortly after speaking with him, my suspicions were confirmed. The children were being abused by the orphanage staff. Dr. Tramis would not name names and said it was best for everyone to keep it all quiet. I couldn't leave things like that. I just... I couldn't. One night, I took the medical files from the infirmary to blow the lid of all this. The watchman must have heard me, and as soon as he saw me with the files, I ran. I left the orphanage and ran. I ran as fast as I could. The watchman was behind me. I couldn't stop to look at him, but I could hear his screams. I ran through the forest to try to lose him, but suddenly I felt a blow on my head and fell to the ground. My head had never hurt so much. I remember the trees pouring red as the blood poured down my face. The taste of iron being dragged through the forest as the branches of the trees dug into my legs. A red moon. A manhole cover. And now, I'm here. Abandoned. And here I will die. No one will ever read these words or know what happened in the orphanage. Everything is darkening. And the only thing regret is that I couldn't save those poor children. It's my fault. Wow. Wow. Very emotional. Holy cow. Whitehaven. So that was it. Wow. Um... Literally, I have no words to say to... I have no words. I'm like... Wow. It did have some pretty good, uh, scares. But I think the story was... Wow. Um, wow. I, I I thought that was pretty good. Believe it or not, I thought that was pretty good. Um, yeah. So, with that being said, that was Whitehaven. I really hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here. And, uh, yeah. Uh, I guess I will see you all in the next video. Stay awesome, and as always, peace out.